what up doe connors today we're gonna to be trying out this new event that i still haven't been able to test out this is the request from the charismatic hero from super dragon ball heroes so this is basically the new event that when we saw in the data download we weren't exactly sure what this was about but it turns out it's basically just a nuking event if you might have seen the missions then you would already know that there are certain missions that require that you score 77.7 .7 million so you know on global we just had the donkey kong bodyguard recruitment test in fact our next batch of uh i think the the new week is going to be starting very very soon so this is basically the same thing and jp players if you guys have done nuking events you already know this so this is just another round of it and considering that it is in the special tab of the uh of the events that means it's not going to be nearly as difficult as uh, some of the other sorts of uh, nuking events that you might be used to so to do this you have to basically use the advantageous category that they provide or they expect you to and you are supposed to try to dish out as much damage as possible you get the damage buff when you're using time travelers you can pick any type that you want so you have to score the 77.7 .7 million on any stage it doesn't matter which one you choose the only difference is the type that the enemy is going to be but you do have to try each event once each stage once so let's say you get 77 million on your first team which is a, te uh, a tech unit right then you go to every other type and just do it you don't even have to score well but just by completing it you will complete all the missions that they ask of you so uh we're gonna be trying this out and i'm gonna start with the trunks because i think the trunks is probably the, gonna be the best way to do this because you can't use nukes like you can't actually use the nuking leads for this so I'm going to go for a 200% unit and I'm going to hope that my max links and all of the supports that I'm running will be enough. I would imagine that it's going to be because we've got insane synergy here. So it's going to be one of these two trunks that has to go. Best link buddy will either be this tech trunks or the STR trunks and my. Then we've got 50% support from this Gohan. We've got a field power bonus coming from this guy when he sets his domain. And then we've also got a two turn support coming from Bulma. So we have a three turn limit. We have to basically use our final attack on the third turn so we can maximize our conditions, so we can dish out the most damage possible. So let's see that we can do that on the int stage. So for int, we're bringing physical. All right, let's do this. And I'm gonna try to do this with every single type in this video if I can. And it looks like, oh my God, this is actually perfect. This is literally the perfect setup. This is literally the perfect setup because I'm going to activate the field power bonus. We're not fighting here in West City. I'm taking this fight somewhere else. And we're going to fight on Sogin, which gives all warriors and beast warriors an attack boost. A little Yu-Gi-Oh reference there. And uh, so now that this guy's given us the field power bonus, that makes our unit stronger. He is not a future Saga character. So now I'm going to rotate him out. And then uh, next turn, when we come back here, I'm going to have the Bulma give us a support. And then I will have both of his best link buddies here. Dude, this is actually going to be the craziest turn ever. Except it's the friend unit. What's the friend unit? Okay, 25 critical. Very good. Max links. Let's go. Okay. All right. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. All right. This is going to be good. So as you can see at the top here, it says remaining charges six. Basically, you use three charges per turn. So we got to do this on uh, on the third turn. Doesn't really matter what we do here. Actually, wait a second. Hold on. Did we just do 60 million damage? Oh my god. We did 51 million damage and I'm not even trying yet. Yeah, this is not going to be nearly as hard as I thought. This is going to be a cakewalk compared to what I was expecting. I thought that this, because you don't have a nuke, you have to like have the most optimal conditions ever. You don't need any of that. Dude, I'm doing 30 million damage on the first turn with base trunks. Oh man, I forgot to turn off. Uh, I forgot to turn off animations. I had these on for the, uh, for the showcases. Hopefully you guys checked out all of the videos that I dropped yesterday. I worked really hard to get all those videos out as soon as possible. 10 videos, man, and that was... That destroyed me. All right, so the key here is just to get the Bulma to pick up five orbs. That's all I care about. If the Bulma picks up five orbs, uh, we win. That's that's basically it. So let me do this. And then does that give us our five orbs? One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. All right, so I'm gonna have the Bulma right here. That gives us two turns of support. And then we are good to go on the next turn. This is my unit doesn't matter i actually think the friend unit has a better crit 
I just I just cleared it. Dude, I just <laughs> I just cleared it. I just hit 99 million. This is way easier than I thought. Yeah. So that's good because this would have been actually pretty horrible if you needed to have like rainbow units max link characters. So, you know, I'm glad we started out like this because we can dial things back significantly. We can dial things back very significantly. Wow. That was, we already beat the event. All right, so I'm going to put this guy in the middle. That gives us full synergy, bro. That gives us full synergy. All right, so I'm going to put this guy first. Now my goal is to just kill this guy. I just want to see if I can kill him. We've got everything that we that we could want. Literally everything that we could want. Everything is set up. I think we take him out. We've got all links active. We got the field power bonus. We got the Bulma residual support. It's over. You lose, Yugi boy. 17.3 million attack stat. Okay. There you go. We're done. That's the first attack. Oh, man. The other. Please. Please. Give me give me 99.999 on all of it. Okay. 84 on a casual slap. Sure. Do I get extra stones for doing this? <laughs> oh! Please kill him. Please kill him. Oh, my gosh. Actually, what happens if you do kill him? Bro, can we kill him? Oh, this is type disadvantage. It's not going to work out. This is actually crazy right now. This guy could do it. This guy could probably do it for tech. Oh, we got so close. All right, first ever attempt. There you go. So we cleared that no problem. I'm going to be doing some more runs with different teams. Uh, but I will tell you that this has drastically changed my plan to do this because I had constructed carefully constructed like 200% teams I don't think we need to do any of that now because now that I cleared this look at that we've got the rest of these and since we got all of these missions done all you have to do is just simply go into the event and clear it just do it you can get five points as a score it doesn't matter you're done so the goal is to basically just hit as hard as you can all right so here's all we have to do so you can just run your own lead at 170% maybe even less if you find a friend unit that benefit from benefits from your own leader skill and the one that he sets that i think that's all you need so i am bringing three support units just random support units not even the most optimal ones kid boo gives you 50 percent support popo gives you 40 percent support pycon gives you 30. so we're kind of scaling it back a little bit so let's see how this goes i'm going to be bringing these units right. onto this same int event don't auto it and it looks like we are not going to have the trunks together. It's just going to be, it's just, okay. So it's going to be a 50% support and a 40% support on turn three. So all I got to do is just build this guy up. So let's, I mean, if anything, I would like to have the Popo do a little bit of supering so that he can raise the attack a little bit, but we really don't have to worry. I, I mean, we're going to, I think we're going to dominate this. I mean, you saw the last score, like that was was nuts and if you can't find a physical i mean dude we're starting out with 53 million damage and we have a cyberman on our rotation if this oh, dude 65 okay so yeah 50 percent more support we clear this easily so if you don't have a friend unit that has the physical lr trunks there will be other units that you could use instead i'm gonna try to do a few of them in this video like, I'll try to do maybe, I don't know, uh, who else would be good? Like, like Tech Fusion Zamasu, that might be a good one. So let me, I think all I really want to do is just set up for the next rotation. We don't even care about launching any attacks, really. Uh, does this do anything? Okay. We don't really care about this guy. I'm curious if this guy could actually do it. I think if that Tech Trunks is on turn one on the AGL run and you give him solid support from the first turn and then he comes back again turn three I think he could also do it okay so yeah we've already got crazy stats uh when uh, yeah we got crazy stats we got crazy key I'm gonna give this to the Popo okay and then I'm gonna put this oh this guy's only at level nine ew 
Okay, so level nine links and rainbowed. So let's do this. And let's see how much damage we can dish out. Let's see what we do. Okay. Here we go. 11.5 million attacks that. We have a 170 uh, 70 percent main lead we're done there you go so yeah you don't even have to do this okay just have the friend you to do all the work that is awesome that is awesome cool cool all right that clears that one all right, I'm going to bring this back now with an extreme future saga team. So hang on a second. All right, so I'm going to try this out now with the Int LR Rose. Um, I would imagine this guy's going to do stupid damage. And we've got all the supports in the world. We've got the Bulma here. We got double 200%. Right, I'm going to try this out. This. And then I'm going to try the Fusion Zamasu afterwards using the same sort of strat that we did before. Also, let me turn off all animations. I don't want to see anything right now. Okay, so Rose is already here. Oh, man, we're going to lose the Bulma support, sadly. You know what? I'll keep Bulma around. I'm going to get rid of the... I'm going to get rid of the other guy. Okay, so let's do this. Uh, I mean, I guess we could... Nah, let's not. Let's not. Let's not waste anything right now. Let's do this. And let's do this. I'm just going to save it until turn three. 9.5 million attacks. We're not even trying and we're close to the oh my god we got 76 million turn one 49 million and he's not even the right type why am i so impressed by this i shouldn't be right okay so none of these guys matter um this turn is irrelevant so let's just do that do that and do that Why is everybody doing so much damage? Oh yeah, time travelers. Right. Okay, and now we have his best linking buddy together. Uh, do we lower defense at all on these supers? Raises defense. No, we don't. All right, I'm going to put Bulma first then. I'm going to have Bulma give everybody a boost. I'm going to do this. Then I'm going to pick up all the int key spheres and we are maxed out. Plus... We've got the best link buddies, so we are packing some serious heat. Uh, if this doesn't get the job done, I got hacked. No, stop it. Dude, Bulma out here just trying to extend the video. What gives? Stop. All right. 19.9 .9 million. We're gonna, yeah, we got it. There you go. Okay, Rose clearly can. All right, so yeah, you don't have to do this. Um, you don't have to be this extensive with your setup. It is very, very straightforward. All right, so we're back, and actually, I'm gonna try something even more unorthodox. I'm gonna bring the trunks as the main lead, which is 170%, and I'm gonna have the friend lead be the Int LR Rose at 150 percent so our leader skill is massively diminished and we only have two supports and i'm curious with this sort of combination what are we gonna get okay so here we do kind of get shafted in terms of uh in, in terms of not being able to do this on turn three we're gonna have to do this on turn two i don't know if we're necessarily gonna have the setup to do that yeah this isn't looking too promising so if i do this uh if i do this and if I do this, maybe. Nope.
All right, let's try this. We got big bad bosses. We got fierce battle. We only picked up three key spheres and our key is at 18. How much are we going to dish out? We got 14.8 million attack stat, 170% lead, 150% lead. This unit has 16 critical built in. We still did it. The conditions were so low and so poor and we still got that 99 million, which we don't even need, by the way. You only need 77 and we got it with that. So that clears it. So this can totally be done with a with a screwed up looking team like this. All right, that's pretty cool. So at this point, all you got to do is just clear out the rest of the stages. Just run through the motion. You don't have to actually, you know, you don't have to score anything high. You just have to basically get this little star marker on every single type and you will clear all the missions and you are done with this event. Is it is it interesting? Sure, it's it's a nuking event that is even easier than the last one. Is it uh, is it practical? Maybe not. But hey, at least you don't have to use those nuking units, right? You don't have to worry about those 50% supports that I'm rocking on some of these videos. That's it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to leave a like down below. Let in the comments your thoughts on the event. What team did you bring? Who was your surprise MVP on this event? Did you try a similar friend setup with the trunks, with the rosé, or somebody else? Let me know in the comments down below. Also, be sure to subscribe for more new content in the future and click the notification bell so that you let you know you want to see more of my stuff. Do it. Thanks again. Stay tuned and Arjun Ritz and Dokkan responsibly.